London is braced to expect hundreds of thousands of revellers descending on the capital with disruptions and delays to public transport expected over the weekend. So, what do you need to know if you're making the journey yourself? Who better to ask than Simon Calder, travel correspondent for The Independent. Morning to you, Simon. Uh, there's so many people want to get down here to see this little piece of history. So wh what are the best ways to plan around this? Well, the very, very much the message, and good morning to you both, is go by public transport and in particular take the train. And that is going to be really significant because, of course, events taking place in central London and pretty much a full service will be running into all the main London stations. The one exception is uh, from London, Water, uh, London Victoria, forgive me, um, to Gatwick and Brighton. But you can get alternative trains to London Bridge. And I think there will be tens, possibly hundreds of thousands of people coming into the main stations and they should have a fairly straightforward journey, I hope. Um, they're even, in the case of Great Western Railway, laying on extra trains. So if you get up early, you leave Cardiff at five in the morning, you'll be in the capital just after seven and you can um, uh, make your way to pretty close to where you are, actually, Stephen and Ellie, and uh, enjoy the atmosphere there. Um, the underground, well, exactly where you are, you all know that you're about a four or five minute walk from um, Green Park Station. Transport for London says all of the um, stations are going to be kept open. However, it might be the case that you will find that some particular stations are, have one-way systems put in um, or they are temporarily closed for entries or exits. But it will be fairly well um, marshalled. As you and, uh, will know, and I've been uh, exploring London over the past couple of days, the whole place is full of, of marshals who will be wearing high-vis jackets and telling you where to go. Um, Really, my concern is going to is actually about Windsor on Sunday when you're going to have you know, over 20,000 people flooding to that lovely Berkshire town and then they've all got to get home after the um, big coronation gig and that's going to be quite challenging. A lot of them will probably get back to central London, the London Waterloo Station, only to find that the um, uh, last tube has gone. So that's going to be a challenge. The airports, of course, we've talked about the strikes which are taking place at Heathrow Terminal 5, security staff walking out there, no great uh, disruption there. And, um, well, you uh, just mentioned in the headlines looking ahead to next weekend where we've got the... Um, as left strike on Friday and the RMT strike on Saturday, shutting down large parts of the rail network, particularly in England, but not nearly so much in Scotland and Wales.